A very good afternoon and welcome to the brief at 30 here on TP1. For the news first team, I'm Rochelle Tumor. Let's start off with a look at your local news. The Freedom People's Congress called a press conference today in Colombo. They claim that the government is using tactics to postpone the local government elections. <laughs> The government is using every possible measure to postpone the local government elections, but none will be successful. It is now being reported that the election commission is divided. This is completely false. There is no division in the election commission. These are fabricated stories. The chairman and four members are of one stance. The proof is in the official Gazette notification. These are false stories coming out from the same source created to mislead the people. Now on to your news overseas, Prince Harry has accused the royal family of failing to defend his wife Meghan in the controversy over the Jer Jeremy Clarkson newspaper column. According to foreign reports, in an interview, the Duke of Sussex said the silence is deafening about the quote-unquote horrific article published last month. He contrasted this with a quick action taken after a race row at a Buckingham Palace reception. Prince Harry said he did not believe comments about his son's skin tone by an unnamed royal were racist. The Clarkson article about Meghan had described how the columnist was, quote, dreaming of the day when she is made to parade naked through the streets of every town in Britain while the crowds chant shame and throw lumps of excrement at her, end quote. Prince Harry further said, quote, the world is asking for some form of comment from the monarchy, but the silence is deafening, to put it mildly, end quote. And finally, on to your sports news, Manchester City will host Arsenal or Oxford United in the Football Association Challenge Cup, fourth round after they beat Chelsea. Reading manager Paul Ince will return to Old Trafford to face former club Manchester United. Britain will host either Liverpool or Wolverhampton Wanderers, while Preston North End will welcome Tottenham Hotspur and National League side Wrexham will take on Sheffield United. The fourth round will take place from the 27th to the 30th of January. And that's a wrap of your news for this hour. Thank you for watching.